Alright, so we're here at Saks Fifth Avenue in Midtown, and this year, this was dedicated by former First Lady Michelle Obama, and it says here it will support the Obama Foundation's Girls Opportunity Alliance to get girls educated. And uh, I'll just say that uh, Michelle Obama did give us a gift this year, along with uh, Saks Fifth Avenue. Very grateful gift that she has uh, given to us this year. We're just going to take a look at it pretty quickly. Walk around here because I'm on my way to Rockefeller Plaza because I got to go to 48th Street to go to the ice skating rink. But yeah, I mean, this is pretty cool. I know I'm going to go to Bloomingdale's another day. That's on the east side. But I love Saks how they always do it. You know? Just wish Lord and Taylor was still around, but we all know what happened to them. <laughs> you know you're in New York when you hear. Yeah, I'm just gonna show you this for a second before we get back to the display. This is Rockefeller Plaza. And I am so glad to see Salvation Army's back. That that's a gift we need right now with these rough almost two years of this pandemic we've been in. I love this. See this is this truly represents winter right here because Hanukkah starting Monday. You got the tree over here. Ah. It's pretty good. I'm sure we would love a holiday carnival in New York City. That would be a true gift. See? <laughs> Look at that, it's Christmas carols. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Listen, I've been coming here regularly since 2015. And I've never seen that. No. I mean, given the pandemic here last year, we couldn't go with all the travel restrictions. But it's so cool. And then, right over here, look what we got. Our friend Rockefeller Center Christmas Tree makes a cameo. And this is the first time I'm seeing the tree in person in two years. What's special about this tree for me is this tree came from Cecil County, Maryland. Shout out to the 410 in Elkton. Look at that. I mean, this is just beautiful. Wait, wait, Dylan, stay here. <laughs> it's almost the end of the display. I'm just going to wait for these people to go by. And again, Special thanks to First Lady Michelle Obama for dedicating this display this year. So we're almost done looking at it. So, almost done. Yeah, so, look at that. That's the holiday display this year at Saks. All right, so Lexington Avenue and 60th Street, right between 59th, home of Bloomingdale's. Now I'm gonna take a look at their holiday display, so let me take my max down. Doesn't look that crowded today, so that's good. Figured, you know, when I would come back on a Monday, you know, let's take a look at their display this year. Look at the, uh, look at this. This is very creative. Dashing into the holiday. I love the name of it. 
This is pretty cool. I love the truck. So, love these. Look at that. This is 1990 style rims. <laughs> Look at the toolbox. That's very, very innovative. I love this already. I mean, obviously, this isn't as big as Macy's, which I'll be heading down to 34th Street later. So, look at that on my camera. This is pretty cool. From all of us at Bloomingdale's, we wish you and yours a holiday filled with nostalgic good cheer. Well, let's hope we have a good holiday. Cause it's, looking, it's looking better this year. It's looking much better. Cool games. This looks pretty, yeah, this looks pretty cool. I will say that. Yep. Looks so cool. Magical memories. <laughs> I mean, we're almost at the end of the display anyway, but... It's a, it's a much smaller one, but, you know, Bloomingdale's always does it every year. Cozy comfort, yeah. This is something Walter should consider putting this in their museum. I could see a museum of art in this Metropolitan Museum of Art, that's it. Yeah. Now this is pretty cool. Dinosaur Christmas tree. Totally rad. That's something from the 80s, but... Look how cool these dinosaurs are! Yeah. <laughs> We got this. All right, so it looks like this is the uh, looks like this is the end. Unless there's some ex something extra on 59th Street, there might be. I don't know. All they have is just uh, Louis Vuitton bags, which you truly can't even afford. Yeah, so that's gonna do it. So that's the display here at Bloomingdale's. In Midtown. All right, we're at the Macy's display, and one notable thing I noticed from my birthday: the outdoor dining area has been taken away from here. So that's one thing. They even put a menorah up here. That's pretty cool. So anyhow, let's take a look at Tiptoe. That's the new display for this year. I couldn't do it last year. Come here because of COVID. So I'll take my mask down since uh, nobody's really here. Once upon a time, in the land of ice and snow, there was an adorable reindeer by the name of Tiptoe. Together with Polar Pear and Penguin, the trio so dear, the magic of friendship, days filled with laughter and cheers. So here's Tiptoe in her glory. I want to get a picture for the, <laughs> for the thumbnail because we're going to aim to put this video up on Christmas Eve. Should be seeing this on Friday, December 24th. So here we go. Looks pretty cool. I love this. I love this. <laughs> Off to flight school to chase their dreams, where the wise old hour teaches magic schemes. Reindeer near and far come to prepare for Santa's test practice makes perfect. He only takes the best. So there you go. It's a lot more shorter than years past, so let's maybe it's my imagination. Uh, senior characters going down West 34th right now. As Christmas draws near, tiptoe studies late into the night. Friends by her side provide encouragement and warm light. But her confidence is low. She is simply too shy. Maybe next year, she says with a sigh. Poor tiptoe. That's pretty cool. I love these Christmas trees. <laughs> Thank you. I am fantastic. Salvation Army's here. So I'll do my good deed later today before I head out when I'm recording this video. Okay. I've got cool this Polar Bear and Penguin knew they had to act fast. 
we need a plan before Christmas is passed. They got in their friends with Bob and Barbara's scheme. Then it is we'll create our own flying machine. The seesaw goes up and down and tiptoe takes flight. That's what friends are for, sheer delight. <laughs> Yeah, this is so cute. Look at reindeer. Look at reindeer. I mean, she's trying to get up. It's like Rudolph, you know, the legendary tale. There we go. Don't look down now. She can't believe this is this high. The black and feather friends keep tiptoe in the sky. Little does she know the rope is untied. Not until she hears them all cheer. You did it. You're fine. I have to say, I think this is the second best display I've ever seen. Compared to my first time I came here six years ago, in 2015 for the Peanuts display, I mean, that didn't require narration. That never did. <laughs> Christmas is here and it's time to pull Santa's sleigh. Her fears are now gone and she's up and away. And with the gift of courage that she has received, from this day forward, Tiptoe knew anything is possible. She just had to, as Macy's would always say, believe. Look at Tiptoe, she's up in the sky. <laughs> There's more on uh, 34th Street as usual, I'm gonna take a look at in just a second. So obviously when you go on 35th over here, there's normally never anything down here. It's just bland and boring. So we're gonna go on 34th Street next. All right, so we're now on West 34th Street. I'm on my way to Penn Station because my train on the Port Washington branch is leaving shortly. Test your memory, wow, okay. And they even have virtual tip time. That's cool. Tiptoe even has a mobile game. Look at this, they still kept the turkey. That's useful. <laughs> yeah, normally they have a lot more on uh, 34th Street side. I guess this year they didn't. Because uh, when I was last back here in 2019, I uh, saw something here. But I guess maybe this year, I guess they just changed it up. You know, <laughs> and no Macy's Thanksgiving insignia on the street you know we're, we're here after thanksgiving i mean hey what was better me going to see the balloon inflation or coming down here and seeing this <laughs> you know if i'm in new york next year that's even there's a lot of possibilities if i'm back here i am going to make sure i'm here the day before thanksgiving that's the one gridlock alert day i make an exemption for Sun's going on over here. I don't know what. I wonder what's up. I think I hear a car alarm going off. Let's go solve the mystery to wrap up this video. I think it's coming from here. Oh boy, I think somebody tried going into the emergency exit. Anyhow, here's something. Okay, we found something. Okay. Yeah. They have a toy display. That's something useful. Look at that. More toys are over here. Yep, and I'm about to approach Penn Station. So, I think I'm going to wrap up this video here from Midtown Manhattan. So... With that, wish you all a very happy holiday. I know Hanukkah's passed, so if you are observing tomorrow, Merry Christmas. Because again, you should be seeing this video on Friday, December 24th. So until the next one, please take care.